centerpieces for International Natural Hair Meetup Day. We're making, these are the centerpieces that we're going to have on the table and I want to tell you how I made them. I'm excited about it and uh, just want to share with you how we did that. We took images from Essence Magazine each month has the horoscope and they have these stylized pictures of sisters with afros and we thought they were really nice and so we took a light and a dark one, dark one, dark one, a light one, a light one, light backgrounds and two with light backgrounds, two with dark backgrounds and we put them on we scan the images and we put them on shipping labels we used um, 3M full sheet shipping labels, permanent adhesive because it kind of has its own glue built in and it's eight and a half by eleven and we used the laser type and we scanned them and we created two images like this we ended up with images like this and we took some boxes from Michaels and lined the boxes with um, plastic take the plastic on the inside of the box and put a little bit of the uh, florist styrofoam just to hold them in place and we used styrofoam cups and I got the bouquet from Farmer Joe's Trader Joe's, sorry, Trader Joe's, Trader Joe's, and I put the bouquet in the styrofoam with water and set it down in there like that, and it kind of holds it in place, and it's sort of a low profile, and so it looks like this on the inside, and I got the styrofoam from the dollar store, like four pieces in there, and didn't need to use all of it, but I put it inside the box like that, and then... I take the labels. Let me score them over right here. Gonna even meet on the edges. I love these photographs. I think uh, our attendees at International Natural Hair Meetup Day uh, are gonna be pleasantly surprised by the centerpieces. And little touches like this go a long way, just making people feel that they're at, you know, this is a festive occasion and something special is happening and and I, I appreciate the little touches so I know a lot of other people do also so you peel it off and it's perfect, it's not too sticky, you can work with it it's easy to do and we decided, we did it a couple ways and we decided we kind of like the white border at the bottom since we're going to have the linen tablecloth so and this sort of mends and melds into the um, bottom there. Here we go. Sticking it on. I don't know if I'm, you can even see this on the camera. But this is so nice because even it's it's sticky, it's not too sticky and you can sort of manipulate it a couple of times if you don't kind of get the placement right. You can always go back and do it again. So here we go. I want it to be closer to the top, more edge on the bottom. Line it up. These images are so fun and so funky. So. And it's so nice and easy to do because if you get any air pockets in, you can just lift it up and redo it. That's one, that's half of, half of it done. And then we will do the other half, taking the other two images and do the exact same thing. What's so nice about this paper, it's already scored in different places when you print on it. So it peels off really easy. And now we put, I think I forgot to score that, but that's okay. And I try to line it up with the other image on the other side as far as the width from the top, the space that's on the top and the bottom. Yeah, maybe you want to do the insides. Um, a little after you do the, uh, 
You can make all the components for the insides, but I don't know that I would put it together until afterwards. But here it is. And you have your styrofoam set there so the flowers sit up in between. And then you end up with a table setting that's like this. And we're going to sit on the table sort of at an angle so that when someone is sitting, they can see two images. And with the flowers, it just pops and it's just whimsical, fun, extra little piece. And I think it's going to add to the uh, celebration for our International Natural Hair Meetup Day in Oakland. This is Dawn. Hope you liked my little idea. I think it's clever. <laughs> Bye-bye now.